hey, puppy, will you let me know when the students are ready uh, to hear me? Okay. Oh, are we on now, puppy? Oh, puppy, I, I need you to move just a little bit. Okay, move over just a little bit. Sorry about that. Uh, hello, it is me, Mr. Warner, and it is our last week in April of 2020. And I'm coming to you today with just a short message uh, to talk to you about just a couple things. One, first of all, of course, I've got a riddle. I saw so many of you last week in your classrooms and so many of you wanted riddles. So I've got another riddle for you this week. Um, I'll tell you the riddle right now and then I'll give you the answer at the end of our, our time this morning. Uh, the riddle is this, what invention, what invention lets you look right through walls? Mm. Let me say that again. What invention lets you look right through walls? In just a minute, I will give you the answer. Again, it was great seeing so many of you last week. Um, I will see uh, many more of you this week. I love popping in your classroom, saying hi and uh, hearing of what you're doing at home, which has been just fantastic to hear. And so I'll see you again this week. Um, but I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about a lesson we had back in December. Back in December of 2019, we talked about random acts of kindness, and we talked about giving, and we talked about how, remember, if this is you up on the top, okay, if this is you up on the top, and you do a random act of kindness for two people that most likely they'll probably do a couple random acts of kindness for a couple other people and so on and so on and so on. And so we had a lot of talking in December about those acts of kindness where when we do nice things for other people, it tends to spread and people really like uh, receiving it, but they also like to know that they're being cared about and so on. So when we talked about that back in December and we talked about giving, it's made me think about the last couple of weeks and just how many people have been giving uh, to you and to me and uh, to everybody. Uh, our parents have been giving to us. Our grandparents have been giving their time and energy. Our teachers at Oakview have been working so hard to try and give you guys the best lessons uh, possible. So there has been a ton of giving. Students, make sure, okay, every day you try to say thank you to somebody, okay? Try to say thank you to someone in your life who's been giving a lot um, to you, whether it's their time, whether it's their ideas, maybe it's your teacher, whoever. But every day, try to give a big thank you to someone, okay? Because they'll appreciate it. And again, by you thanking someone, you're spreading that kindness. You're spreading that kindness, which is so important. Um, to help you uh, be thinking a little bit more this week about giving and what you can do, uh, I am giving your teachers um, a little read aloud from me. Uh, this book always comes to mind when I think about giving. I'll show you. Many of you have seen it. It's The Giving Tree by Shel Silverstein. Um, there's a read aloud from me on uh, on a link that your teachers will give you. And uh, listen to it. It'll give you some ideas of just what giving is all about. Okay. Now, let me give you the answer to that riddle. And then I've got one final thing to share with you. Remember, the riddle was, what's something, an invention that lets you look right through walls? Mm. Puppy, do you know what the No, he doesn't know. A window. A window lets you look right through walls. Ah, that's a good one. So again, this week, be sure to thank someone who's been giving a lot to you. Thank your teachers. And uh, listen to the story of the giving tree. And keep reading, keep doing your math, keep doing all the things that you've been doing. And I will talk to you guys soon. Oh, and if you wait just one second, I'll put that slide back up on the screen of how you can reach me uh, during the week if you want to talk. Again, so many of you talked with me last week. It was great to hear from you. So again, reach out to me again this week. Thanks, and you guys have a great one.